guys, Ryan here coming at you with another video. This time it's about work boots, specifically these cat work boots. If you're like me, work boots normally only last me a year, a year and a half. If I'm being real gentle on them, doing commercial rooftop work, I'm banging them off gas lines, uh, climbing up ladders, uh, just putting them to work. So are the good people over at Caterpillar Boots. Uh, asked me to do an honest review on these boots. They sent them to me. So I'm gonna do an honest review on the boots. I've had them about three months now and I've been wearing them sporadically throughout work. I wanted to keep them somewhat nice for the video, but I have been rocking them. These specifically are the Cat Men's Threshold Rebound Waterproof Work Boot. Obviously they're a waterproof boot, or at least like all boots are, they're waterproof at first. Uh, until you wear them in and work in them. These so far have been uh, good, nice and waterproof. I'm not walking through a, a foot of water in them, but I have been out in them in the rain. I have walked through some puddles. My feet stayed dry. So it says waterproof right on the side and brand new. They are fairly tight and my feet stayed dry while I wore them out while it was raining. They are a safety toe, composite safety toe. So not steel. Not sure exactly what's in there that's protecting your toes, but they are um, a safety toe, composite safety toe. And as you can see, I've already uh, scuffed them up a little bit wearing them. It says they got a slip resistant durable sole. Um, they do. I haven't been sliding around. A lot of those white roofs are pretty uh, slippery when they're dewy in the morning uh, before the sun bakes it off. And uh, the soles seem nice and it's a quality full grain leather upper and they're nice I can tell you that uh, what I really liked about the boot was taking them out of the box they were comfortable it felt like they needed no breaking in uh, whatsoever a very comfortable boot I can tell you that um, getting old my feet ache a little more than they used to uh, they got a nice cushiony insole uh, it says cat tech revive engineered they're a nice boot and they're not a bad looking boot either uh, they're a little lighter weight which was nice for summer um, I'm not sure about the insulation they seem a little thin but for summer work it's a perfect boot for me it's not super heavy and uh, it's keeping my feet protected uh, with the safety toe and the slip resistant sole it says here on the inside 100% recycled post-industrial lining. So it looks like they're uh, recycling to make the liner of the boot. Nice shoelaces on them. All in all, they're a good boot. Uh, for the price, even at that, they're at, uh, like about 144 bucks. Um, and you know, you can spend up to 350, you can spend as much money as you want on boots. Me personally, I like to stay below $200 on boots because for me, it doesn't matter if they're $140 or they're $500. I'm getting about a year, a year and a half out of them. And that's trying to take it easy on them, but I'm pretty hard on boots. And uh, I'm assuming these boots are gonna last about a, a year, a year and a half, uh, possibly two years if I cycle some of my other boots uh, into the mix. of. I've got some really insulated boots I wear in the winter when it gets really cold. So if I take it easy on these and don't beat them hard, I, I could see these last in two years, maybe three years. Um, but right off the bat, I got nothing bad to say about the boots. They're relatively inexpensive, $144. Uh, right out of the box, they were comfortable. And uh, I'm gonna continue to wear them. But uh, Caterpillar work boots, not bad. If you're looking for a good pair of boots, check these ones out. Uh, I'm certainly going to be wearing them, and I'm sure you'll see me wearing them in some future videos. There's going to be a link in the description if you want to check out these Cat Caterpillar work boots. Composite toe, slip resistant, full grain leather, nice laces, uh, cushy insole, uh, recycled uh, post-industrial lining. Not quite sure what that means, but hey, I'm all for it. Check them out, guys. Check the link in the description. It's not a, I'm not getting any money off of that or anything like that. They simply sent me the boots, wanted me to try them, and 
I don't have anything bad to say about them. It's a little hard to make a boot review video when you have only been wearing them three months. Um, we'll see how they hold up in the years to come, but what I can say is they're super comfortable right out of the box. A lot of other boots I get, you try them on and you're wearing them the, the first week, your feet are kind of hurt and you gotta break those boots in. I didn't get any of that from these. They, they bend nicely, my feet are comfortable, so. Um, that's it for the Caterpillar work boot. I like the brown leather, not bad. So I appreciate you sending me the boots, the Caterpillar, and uh, that's my honest review of the boots. 144 bucks, can't go wrong with that, especially in this economy. All right guys, well that's gonna do it for this one. I hope you liked this boot review video. If you did, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell icon, that'll notify you anytime I got a new video coming out. Leave me a comment, hit like, I appreciate you watching, and I'll see you on the next one.